In this tutorial, I'd like to show you LUT Pro from Crumple Pop. LUT Pro allows you to apply LUT files to your video clips. LUT Pro was created exclusively for Final Cut Pro 10. You can find it in the effects browser under Crumple Pop LUT Pro. LUT files are useful for applying creative looks to your footage and also for normalizing footage shot in a flat or log format. On my timeline, I have a clip that was shot on a Blackmagic camera in Blackmagic Cinema Camera Film format. These formats allow a lot of latitude in final color correction, but probably won't look very good to your client as they're unsaturated and low contrast. When I need to normalize the footage or get a proof to my client quickly before doing a color grading pass, LUT Pro is the perfect tool. I'll drop it on the clip. In the parameters, I'll choose Select LUT File and choose the format the file was shot in. As you can see, there are presets for all the major camera formats from Blackmagic, Canon, RED, Sony, and more. Immediately, you can see that the shot looks better. If you need to make further adjustments, LUT Pro gives you some easy but powerful options. There is an auto white balance tool, or you can dial in a specific temperature. There are lift, gamma, and gain adjustments to further control shadows, mids, and highlights. Density allows you to stop the image up or down. I have another clip on my timeline that I'd just like to apply a look to. I have a bunch of third-party LUT files on my machine, and LUT Pro allows me to add those to its LUT menu. I simply need to copy those LUT files to my boot drive, library, application support, Crumple Pop, LUT Pro, Crumple Pop LUT Pro LUTs. Then restart Final Cut Pro. Now I have complete access to them in LUT Pro. LUT Pro from Crumple Pop is a must-have effect for working with footage from modern cameras and a quick and easy way to add some creative looks to your footage. FX Factory offers a huge selection of great effects, and if you don't have them yet, I suggest you go try them out at fxfactory.com.